yourself. Dragon Prime? What's he doing here? Sorry, friend. Classified. That was your best one-liner? I don't hear him complaining. I could have done much better. Save the repartee for the barracks Autobots. Lancer, any comms chatter? No major activity on frequencies, Commander. We're still in the clear. Good. Friendly! Friendly! Oh, I was hoping you'd get lost. With you shining through the darkness like a fluorescent beacon? That'd be a challenge. It's only on six gun. Report. Spotted at least a dozen Decepticon squads still out on the streets. Closest parties are about ten miles out. And Megatron? No visual contact, but definitely heard him. Which means whatever or whoever we're risking our diodes for is important enough to warrant his personal attention. Yeah, when are you gonna tell us what we're here for? It's as good a time as any, Prime. Our window is getting tighter by the second. Let's roll! <laughs> Megatron has taken Rodion. This cannot be denied. Its tactical significance cannot be understated. But I have received word that his interest in this city is more personal. He is hunting down the bot who has been chief in orchestrating its evacuation. Alpha Tryon. Tryon? The former senator? I knew it! You owe me 50 Shannix! Yeah? And what are you going to spend it on in this non-existent economy? Why does Mex want him? So all this, sending in a five-bot team under cover of mortar fire, is all for one old relic of the Golden Age. And a politician at that. Ugh. Do not paint him with the same brush Megatron does. Tryon was one of the few senators who was honest about his intentions and served the people. He is the chronicler of our history, and while one may consider him a relic, it is for that exact reason he must be protected. Congratulations, Cell. You're the only Autobot I've ever met to personally offend the Supreme Commander. You'll want to watch your vocal processor talking about trying that way, soldier. He's been mentoring Optimus ever since the days he went by Orion Pax. Is it true he's one of the Thirteen? I heard he helped Optimus and Megatron defeat the Fallen. As if. Senator Tryon? Come, take a look at this. I've always taken great interest in this planet. Such a lush and varied ecological system. So different to our own and yet so incredibly similar. One of its organic species seems well on its way down the path of evolution now. Still a long way off from tools and fabricating habitats, but failing another extinction level event, I have little doubt they will achieve it. Our lifetimes are a blessing and a curse. My own especially. One can observe the entire life cycle of a species begin, crest, and then disappear like rust in the wind. We have not been acquainted before, have we? No, sir. Captain Orion Pax, Iacon Elite Guard. I was sent to escort you to the Decagon. Orion Pax. Pax, Pax, Pax. Ah, the one who thwarted the assassination attempt on Sentinel Prime. Yes, sir. Any other officer would have shot the assassin without hesitation. 
but you. Violence should never be the first response, sir. I try to teach that to all my cadets. Quite so. I wish more officers were open to the concept. A lot of them probably think we're still at war with the Stentarians. They would rather be soldiers than peacekeepers. Our duty as elite guardsmen is to serve and protect the people. But surely you are also obliged to uphold the law. Correct. And if the law hurts the people? Then the law is wrong. on their way to the Decagon. They know the votes today. Were you a soldier, Pax? No. I wasn't forged during the war. I'm not sure I have the programming for a soldier. What do you expect the Senate will do? I... couldn't say, sir. Oh, don't fret about me, Pax. Tell me what you think. I do not expect the veterans' bill to pass. This is the same government that built them for war, and so quickly abandoned them in peace. Do you? No. I don't expect this Senate to take any action. One questions the point of voting sometimes. With all due respect, sir, to act in defiance of injustice, even if it seems hopeless, is better than acting not at all. All my years, Orion Pax, I've never met someone quite like you. You're one to keep an optic open for. Just what we need. Acid rain. Six gun. Find a sheltered vantage point to keep lookout. No problem, boss. Where you been? There were complications. For those who don't speak understatement, translates to Decepticons. When does it? All right, getaway? Fancy place you got here. Thanks. I was still paying off the mortgage, but the bank was obliterated ten centuries ago. Where is he, getaway? Just through here. Everyone make yourself at home. There's oil in the fridge. Just keep your feet off the table, all right? You got any objects? This is a safe house, man, not a hotel. Yes, Alita. Optimus. Alpha Trion. You risk much coming here. I could never abandon a friend in need. Is everything all right? Well, Perceptor's done some initial meteorological scans. Storm's gonna be here for the next three hours, so we're stuck here until it passes or pH levels improve. How bad is it? Let's just say Six Gun's probably happy not to be in the air for once. Hopefully that means Megatron and his hunting parties will be doing the same. He is unrelenting to be sure, but not stupid. He too will shelter. But we must be on the move as soon as the storm clears. You hear 
hear that? I don't hear anything. Exactly. Alita wants artillery is stopped. We're on a road. I used to be able to see the Roche Nebula on a clear night. Brilliant colors streaked across the sky like Primus himself had painted the heavens with enormous brushstrokes. Now we can't even see our own sun. Can't even remember the last time I did. I'll have to take your word on that. What do you mean? This is the only sky I've ever known. Lancer was one of the last forged before the Allspark was ejected into the Alcaris anomaly. Really? How old are you? Ten. You're ten? Fresh out of Vespertine Blue, me! You're welcome for that, by the way. If I'd been a minute later, you'd have a con badge. Well, purple is my color. Premise alive! Here for me. No god would have let this happen. One day she will know something better. The generations forged from the Allspark after war was declared have a name. They are called Warborn. They have never known a Cybertron unscathed by conflict. Now, we have Autobots and Decepticons who have never seen our own son. Some never will. Things were bad before, but losing the Allspark meant we lost Cybertron's natural detoxifying ecosystem, and the three million year old bloodbath finally caught up with us. Every day for the last ten years, I have told myself it was right. Megatron would have birthed legions of Decepticons if he had claimed the Allspark for himself. For the sake of our life on Cybertron and across the galaxy, it had to be done. I believe the alternative would have been the destruction of all hope. Was it the right decision? Was it worth these acidic downpours? This crimson hellish sky. Bots like Lancer who have never known anything else. Sometimes there is no right or wrong decision. Sometimes there is the only decision, and it falls to a few hapless souls to make it. The old spark may be lost, but I have faith it will be found and our home will live again. Just as I have always had faith in you, Optimus Prime. Optimus, six guns reporting the storm is clearing up. We should make ready to move. Thank you, Hound. Let the others know. Time to go, Alpha. I check those corners. Watch the rooftops. should be up there fighting with them. You are exactly where you need to be, Optimus. Why are we here? Without Sentinel Prime's leadership, the Autobots and Elite Guard will soon fall. Which is precisely the reason I have brought you here. Sentinel was never the one to lead the fight against Megatron's armies. The Autobots, the Elite Guard, the free people fighting back against the Decepticons need someone to inspire them. They need a symbol. They need you.
leadership. But how? Since the days of Nova Prime, the Matrix has resided here, waiting for a new bearer. His successes were Prime only in name, a title passed down to ensure the preservation of the status quo. But now, it calls to you, Optimus. Are you certain I am worthy? I have never doubted it. Accept your destiny. Hide no longer. Become the hope they need. Just one last thing before we go. Something to help you with those Decepticons. Is that... I am Omega Supreme. I am the last guardian of Cybertron. I stand ready to serve you. Omega Supreme. My name is Optimus Prime. Six-gun. Problem. Uh, scrap. We can take this lot, right? We're outnumbered too greatly. Attempting to retake the shuttle would be a death sentence for us all. There'd be one of you Autobots still scurrying about? Where is Alpha Trion? Speak! Starscream! You'll never get anything out of me. Silence! This Autobot was hiding aboard the shuttle and tried to escape, my lord. Clearly, he is part of a rescue attempt. He may know Alpha Trion's location. You idiot Starscream. This is just the pilot. Why else would he steal me aboard the ship? Go to the pit. I'll never tell you anything. <laughs> of course you won't. You don't know anything. This mission is top secret, after all. But you know Optimus Prime is leading it, I'm sure. How did you know? Because I know Optimus. And I know that all of this is personal. Decepticons! 
The Autobots are close! Search every street! Every building! Kill any Autobot you may encounter! But Alpha Triumph is mine! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That goes doubly for you, Starscream. You serve this moment for your own glory at your peril. Of course, Lord Megatron. I wouldn't dream of it. I don't remember him looking so spiky before. Optimus, the Autobots need you more than they need a rust bucket like me. Let me surrender myself and all of you can get out safe. I will not leave you to Megatron. They're only after me. Please. I did not come all this way to hand you over to that tyrant. Optimus. No. I'll fall back to the secondary rendezvous. And let Ratchet know we're on our way. Well, this is a goddamn kill box if I ever saw one. Optics up for snipers, Autobots. Hound, pick point, and be careful. He's fire. He's gone. Him and all pretense of stealth. Get away. I'm sorry, Alpha. Lord Megatron, this way! I heard gunfire! We've got to move, Prime. Get Jaron out of here. Don't wait up. Exelion? Answer. We'll take up defensive position here. Hold off Megatron as long as we can. Optimus, this is foolishness! Get him out of here! How many coming? I count eight. Sounds like a fair fight to me. Gonna be okay. <coughs> what is he doing? If he wants to walk right into the line of fire, that's none of my business. Optimus. I presumed you would be here. 
You're looking different, Megatron. <laughs> Spoils of war, Prime. Do you approve? The armor of a god befits an emperor, does it not? Come out, let us talk. You have my word that you will not be harmed. And what value has that ever had, Megatron? I recall you quickly reneged on our last alliance to protect Cybertron from your namesake. All I want is Tryon. You'll have him over my cold chassis. You continue to baffle me, Prime. Your unshakable devotion to this traitorous walking scrappy. It's truly embarrassing. Like a steel jaw fawning over its beloved master. Unlike you, Megatron, I am capable of loyalty. My first loyalty is to Cybertron! A home! You cannot seriously believe that Tryon's actions were in the interest of the planet and our species! What does he mean? never said why Megatron wanted to try on. Alpha Tryon's actions were in the interests of Cybertron. If he had not intervened, future generations would have been corrupted by your twisted schemes. He took our future and cast it into the void! You Autobots think yourself so high-minded and noble, and yet you refuse to condemn the very heart of our world, the Allspark, being ripped from its body and flung into the Alkyrus Anomaly! He did what? So... I'm here, Lent. I... never... All this for the bot who killed Cybertron. Elida, this is Optimus. I need a firing solution on my position immediately. What are you doing? Time's up, Prime! Surrender Tryon to me, and I will let you and your Autobots go! Nobody else need die today! Incoming!
I know Megatron wanted this honor himself, but I gladly accept it in his absence. This wasn't about you. Besides, look at the state of you. I would never squander my opportunity to kill you when you look so wretched. When you die, I want us to be even. Not a gun. Look after Hound. This is not a good way. Losing too much energy. You have to do something, Ratchet. Optimus. Save your energy, Alpha. I failed. I failed you. I've failed our planet. No, no, that is not true. I, I condemned it to die. My sentence was inevitable. The others... Far too young. So much possibility. <coughs> Ratchet! I'm losing him. His spark is going into arrest. Doctor, you know there's nothing you can do for me. Prime, I can stabilize Hound, but Tryon, his... His spark is giving out. I'm sorry. There's too much internal damage. 
The Hound has a chance, but I need to take over from Nautica. You knew. You spawn of a glitch, you knew! You knew what he did and you protected him! And for what? Getaway, six gun Lancer? God, Lancer? She never knew anything but this hellscape you helped create! How long did you plan to keep it a secret from us? Or were you just going to sit on this information to protect Tryon's reputation? You may have not been the one to throw away the Allspark, but you let it happen under your watch. And here we are. Our homeworld a lifeless, broken shell, and three more Autobots dead for nothing thanks to your blinkered loyalty and lousy leadership. Back down! You are talking to your Supreme Commander! Not my commander anymore. Ixalion, please understand. Alpha Trion did what he did to give us a chance against Megatron. He understood the ramifications of his actions. I know why he did it. Doesn't make it right. Where will you go? To Megatron? Just because I'm done with the Autobots doesn't make me a Decepticon. You can all kill yourselves in the dark. I'm gonna see this guy again. For her. Consellian, stop! Let him go, Chromia. He's made his choice. Is he... all right? He's stable, Optimus. He's gotta be okay. But we should get him back to a medical facility promptly. See to it. You okay? I am uninjured, Ratchet. That's not what I meant. Right. I failed them. Six gun. Lancer. Get away. And every day we stay here, I fail more of them. I will not let their deaths be for nothing. I swear it. Never forsake our future to preserve the past. I realized that far too late. 
was Tryon wrong to release the Allspark into the universe and doom our planet to die? I do not know. As he himself said, sometimes there are no right or wrong decisions, only the decision. And it is my unenviable burden to make it. And so, with a heavy spark, I make this decision. I have held on to Cybertron, to our past, for far too long, at the cost of too many lives. Our planet can no longer sustain us. For the sake of our future, we must leave Cybertron. Find new sources of energon and build a new amongst the stars. Lancer 1, set for jump. We will find the Allspark in one day. When this war is over, we will bring it home. And the new generation will at last see the sun. Navigational sensors and chronometer recalibrating. Cybertron. What has happened to Cybertron? Who has done this to my world? 